Look at me, 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 look at me now. Fuck, are you kidding me? You're my You ready? As this fight gets underway, and you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist, but on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true five-tool player. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Right punches there. Good series of strikes for him there, staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. And now he's got the tie clinch. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. He landed a beautiful straight punch there, DC. He's got an edge in reach and certainly is making it count in this one. Nice defense there, huge block. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. These guys throwing early. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Head kick partially blocked. Kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Just over three minutes to go in our first round. That was a nice strike. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Good stick. Right on the button. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Nice one-two there. Just try to establish that jab. Punch over the top. Flips the punch. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Ooh, head kick lands, it's hurt. Lee gets hit with a kick. Going to the body there with the right kick. Just out of range with that right hand. Lee gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. That was a thudding leg kick. Plans a slanting right hand upstairs. Well, you saw us reference it in the tail of the tape, DC. He's got the reach advantage and certainly made good use of it there in landing that jab. They continue to exchange. Well, a lot of people think he might have the best jab in this division, certainly using it effectively here. I mean, one of the best jabs in the world across all combat sports. The way that it just comes out, it's beautiful. The backside hand is always at the chin. The elbows tuck to the ribs. The jab goes out. The jab comes right back to the face. It's picture-perfect technique, almost like a Taibo class or something like that. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. 
Nice counter shot there. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Sound defense there as he blocks the shot. Just out of range with that left hook. Left punch is true. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and I'd imagine a lot of these replays are gonna be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're gonna see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Well, he's been good tonight, but he missed with that one. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Oh, big right hook, but a whiff. Oh, collar tie. Oh, huge block. Man, doesn't take much for the redness to start. Look at the left side of his body. They're nasty. And he landed the right hand there. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Whip his hip into that kick. Oh, really using his reach advantage there with that punch, DC. And they separate. Swing and a miss by Lee. Just over three minutes to go. Pretty good right hand. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Effective punch there by Lee. Oh, and there he goes again, working off that beautiful jab. He continues to keep his opponent at distance. I mean, keeps him at bay with that beautiful, precise jab. It is like a piston. It goes in and out, and before his opponent can even realize what hit him, he's already hitting him with another one. Right. I love, love watching this man fight because of that beautiful, educated jab. And both guys really throwing with authority. Nice punch land over the top. Clocks the shot. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Nice strike. Went for the inside leg kick. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Connects with a right. That right hand hurt him a little bit. A little clean, tight combination there. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Got the single collar tie. Liver kick. What 
a body kick. Switching stances here. Going back to his patented kicks here, but unable to find the target there. Got clipped with the right hand. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. He's giving him so many different things right now. Big knee to the body. Able to check that kick as well. All right, single collar tie now. Beautiful strike. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Ten minutes in the books. All right, a lot of high-level striking action in that last round. Daniel, take us through it if you will. Tit for tat. Who has the best chin? It seemed as though they were looking for that answer. Both guys took risk. What a fantastic round. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take their turn. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight idea. Just missed with the straight left hand. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Oh, that's a good strike there by Lee. Huge block there. And once again, looking for that highlight reel KO with that front kick. Nice kick. Headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure nothing lands. Wow, what a kick. Huge kick lands. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Beautiful head kick. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attack. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Big body kick land. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. Nice body kick right on the elbow. Back and forth we go! Well, not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Nice job to land the kick to the body there by Lee. Big punch lands through the middle. Shows him the left and then follows it up with a right. Nice one and two punch there by Lee. And they separate. Big head kick land. Clipped him with the right hand there. All right, so he continues to land that jab. His opponent said he was ready for it, but doesn't appear to be. You're not ready until you're in there. You can watch all the film you want. 
You can spar as much as you want, but until you feel a guy with a fast jab like this, you don't understand the precision of that punch. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Now connects with the right. Can't take many of those, you better check. Throws the right hand there. Single collar tie now. Just missing on the uppercut there. Oh, lands another beautiful strike to the body. Really starting to connect at will when it comes to work in the body, and especially effective doing it later in this fight. Didn't see a lot of that from him in the earlier rounds. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be, and if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Oh, that's a nice strike. Nice head kick. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. Flips the shot. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed the seminal blow on that one. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting it over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. All right, next round is underway, and if you look at these two guys in between rounds, it looks like they've barely broken a sweat, both with good resting heart rate, stamina still very high, and you just have to log the efforts of these guys in training. Both men certainly noted cardio specialists, but incredible that they would have this much in the tank after 10-plus minutes of fighting. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. Big kick. Wow. Real nice body can land. And now he's got that tie clinch. We'll see what he can do with it. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down. Uh, great technique on the overhand, now he's hurt. That's one of those shots that if you take one of them, they can get the ninth down from that and right on the spot. Ooh, what a punch. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. Go finish this fight. Man, look at his torso. That just can't feel good. Look at the size of that bruise on his body. And you got to think his opponent is going to continue to attack that area. And they separate. Nice kick. Oh, nice straight there. I guess that's the quickest way to the target, right? Just throw straight. Straight down is always best. Big body kick. Trying to go to the body here. Unable to find the target. Oh, big punch land. Whoa! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. He's in trouble. He's getting lit up. Big kick land. Oh, big damaging knees here to the body. Just missed with the left there. Nice job of hiding that head kick. Nice loop and punch. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Back 
to the jab now, no good. Kick to the body by Lee. Under two minutes now to go. Big kick land. Oh, and he caught the kick. Let's go. Keep moving forward now. Don't worry. Strong defense there to block this. This fight's gonna be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent, thought he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Big head kick land. Nice straight punch. Trying to establish that jab once again. Oh, that right hand is on point. Went for the inside leg kick. Under a minute now to go. Lee gets caught by that straight hand. Watch the shot. He missed with that jab attempt there. Oh, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Oh, big shot lands. Real sneaky body. Back and forth we go. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gotta be over very soon. All right, so he lands a jab there. Pretty nicely done, DC. You can really control a fight just knowing how to fight behind the jab. 20 minutes down, potentially five to go. All right, let's now look back at some of the action from that round. He went headhunting, landed, nearly got the finish, too. A lot of coaches tell you don't headhunt. In this case, he's been headhunting, and he landed a big enough shot to truly put his opponent on notice. There. He told us Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight, and that is certainly a step in the right direction. He has landed that strike. He's very effective with it. The issue with that kick, as effective as it is, one gets checked, you have the end of the oh! situation. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Whoa! Oh, he might be out. All right, he's got the full mount now. Is this one of the most dominant positions? And that's going to do it. I'm not sure if that's the way he drew it up, but a huge result for him here tonight as he gets the win by way of knockout, and that's about as good a one-strike finish as we've seen here in the UFC in recent memory. I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, so a big, big win for him here tonight. All right, DC, no Telestrator tonight, but we're gonna get you some highlights from this one. This was a fight that had it all, and for my money, his best performance to date. His best performance to date in the biggest moment. In the biggest moments, you gotta show up. And that's exactly what he did tonight. He used every bit of his skill to get the job done. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. 
Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 17 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Well, we congratulate him on a huge knockout here tonight. He'll probably keep that smile while he's sleeping tonight after.